Welcome back to Pool School. My name is Jason Hughes and today we're going to talk about how a swimming pool filter system works. We're going to take a look at our equipment here and we have our major components. We have a pump timer, we have our swimming pool pump, we have our filter. We also in this case have a salt water chlorinator which is not requisite to have. We, simply, we just simply have this on here as our sanitation. We're primarily going to talk about the function of the pump the uh, filter and the plumbing and how all this works together. So what you have, uh, you have water that's coming from the pool over to this point. The water is coming in through these two pipes. One of these is coming from a skimmer. The other one's coming through the main drains in the back, uh, back wall at the bottom of the floor of the pool. And this water is pulled into the pump. This is called the suction side. So everything on this end is being sucked into the pool pump here. In this pool pump we have a basket this is called a strainer pot and that's a secondary means to filter the water and catch any debris that might be in the water before it gets into the, the actual pump uh, chamber where the impeller spins. So our water is pulled in here from our skimmer, from our main drains, it goes through our strainer pot basket, it gets into the pump housing here and then we have our water coming out of the top of the pump and that's called the discharge side of the plumbing or the pressure side. So suction side, we get to the pump, this is our discharge or pressure side our water is being pushed into our cartridge filter. The filter uh, serves to trap the debris that's in the water and it filters and polishes the water. And then our clean water comes back out here, goes to our chlorinator cell, and then back to our pool. We always want to make sure that the last thing we do with our water before it gets to the pool is chlorinate it. You want to, because if you were to put the chlorinator before a filter, before a heater, then you're introducing a high level of chlorine into those components which is bad for the equipment. So there you have it. That's the basics on how a swimming pool filter works. Uh, for more information visit www.poolschool.us and www.riverpoolsandspas.com.